There we go. All right. It should be up. Can you see it? Let me see. Let me refresh. It should. It, the game isn't isn't set properly now, but whatever. You know the uh, uh, stream title. <laughs> Code name. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're live. We got it. Code name okay. Viper. So easy, normal, or difficult? Uh, just normal. Normal it is. I don't think I've ever played on this difficulty level. So, we're Agent Smith, and that's Commander Jones. Located the hi seven hideouts of huge drug syndicate in South America. Oh, that is delightful. We have a cigar in the mouth of our commander, and we have drug syndicates in an NES game. Oh, man, so edgy. I know! Nintendo of America, what happened to your sensors? <laughs> Drug references? Somebody smoking? I mean... Seriously. It's a risk. I mean... Considering the content of this game, you wonder why they would make it so that they took Hitler out of Bionic Commando. Hitler was a Bionic Commando? Yes. For that matter, they took out his name, but they left his image. Oh, so it's like sunglasses, Hitler. I don't know. Anyway, You've so never you seen sunglasses, Hitler? Have you? No. I will have to find that image for you because it is amazing. So in this game, you have two possible weapons. You have your handgun that you start with, and you can have a machine gun. The machine gun tr only helps because it. Uh, makes you fire faster, that's all. I'm concerned about the fact that the guy you're playing is, uh, naked. At He's the not. Waist. Those are pants. They don't look like pants. Well... They really don't. They're not shorts, so... I guess there's that. Couldn't they at least have just given him the same color oh, pants? man, that guy jumped into my face. And now I have to start over with my dinky little gun. Okay. Thank you, guy. He respawned on me real quick. I'm gonna get my bullets back. Fortunately, if you rescue anybody, if you die, you don't have to re-rescue them. Oh, that's good. Can't remember what... No, it, I didn't get my machine gun yet. Come on, jump up here. Jump. Jump. Thank you. Uh, was it up here? No, there was a little boy in there. Uh... I rescued a little boy. He even thanked me. Did you at least wear pants? I'm wearing pants right now! So, the machine gun doesn't really help things. Because er, even the, the enemies all have recoil. Really? Like when you oh, shoot them? Oh, then I bounce away. Yeah. Huh, also, you can find skeletons that don't count for anything in behind these doors. I'm getting so many Russian attack vibes from this game. This game is very, very like another game called Rolling Thunder by Tengen, which I think was unlicensed. Uh, okay. That's a game that sh I should pick up at some point, even if I've, I'll never beat it, because it's like a really hard game. Russian Attack is a unique game. More machine gun bullets, can always use those. See, I try to make sure I only fire one machine gun bullet at a time. Because it's it's a waste otherwise. Oh, nope. There's a guy over there with a gun. Got him. You must always be wary of the guy with a gun. Katsu was such an asshole. What? 
Okay, in Bushido Blade and Bushido Blade 2, there's a mid-boss called Katsuse. Everybody else uses swords, he uses a handgun. So the idea is you're supposed to make him run out of bullets and then make him reload and stab him in the head while he's doing that. It's much harder than it sounds. Oh hey, I got an extra life, because I got 20,000 points. I probably said his damn name wrong. Whatever. So, there's this dude, this kind of older man that you get to rescue from one of these doors. And, uh... He, uh... He'll give you a bomb that you have to use at the end of the, uh... At the end of the stage. Right here. Okay. And it lets you through the door, which ends the stage, basically. That's... That's interesting design, I guess. And at the end of every stage, a guy comes and gives you some words on a page. And you'll get a little bit more of this page as the game goes on. So for right now, we don't know what the purpose is, and we don't know how much is uh, how much of what, and, you know, we don't know who's paying. And then we get this neat little image that doesn't really make any difference. And we get points for our time left over. See, he's wearing pants in that image. He's wearing pants in all of it. <laughs> so we just went through the jungle level. Now we're going to the warehouse level. Oh, me warehouse. Cool. Also, be careful. The pink ones actually shoot you. The gray ones take one shot. The blue ones take two shots. The pink ones take one shot, but they also shoot you, whereas the gray and blue ones don't. Oh, big deal. You can just crouch. Well, that's true. For them. You can duck on those guys. So, are those... Uh, is there, like, some stealth mechanic I'm seeing here? Nope. No? You're hiding in doors, usually. Well, okay, there is in a way, but I'm checking the doors. I'm not hiding in them. I'm trying to see if there's anything in them for me, like bullets for my various guns, for my two guns. Or if there's people to rescue, like that woman. And, of course, you have right, to... Right, but you, it seems like you're staying inside the doors. Well, yeah, I will if there's somebody walking towards me fast enough that I can't get out of the door in time to shoot them. I'll stay... I, I, can, I can hold the up button to stay behind the door. Oh, uh, okay. See, that's what I was wondering. So, I, okay, that's an interesting mechanic. Not really intuitive, but... I'm sorry, but the entire time I'm watching this, I'm just thinking Karnov. I don't know why I'm thinking Karnov. I don't know why you're thinking Karnov either. I have so many handgun bullets. You won't use your handgun if you have machine gun bullets. Does machine gun just do more damage? No, they do equal damage. But the machine gun fires faster, and, well, machine guns the bullets. So, yeah. The thing is, if you just barely press the fire button... Oh yeah, those black guys wearing white take two shots and they fire at you. <laughs> That's what they are! Well, oh, nope, I died. I was trying to hit that guy, and I was hoping that I would have. Oh well. And now I'm back down to just having a handgun. Because you lose your guns if you die. That's an interesting death pose. What, when he fi falls face forward and... Ass up, face in the pillow? Yeah. It's like he's just saying, come, take me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm checking these again because I don't know why. I'm not going back over there. I'm just going to come up here. Get extra time. It's in 
here's bones. Why did they kidnap skeletons and just kind of tie them to doors? I think they died there. Rest in peace. There's the guy. I was looking for this guy. Now you can beat the level. Now I can beat the level, yes. Ah, no, the firebomb guy. Oh, good. He ran under me and didn't see me, apparently. He throws firebombs. And by that, I mean they're, they're, it's like Molotov cocktails, basically. And if they hit you, it hurts. So yeah, now we know it's our purpose is as much as possible and, I mean, oh, and pay attention to that skull. It says something, I think, underneath of the skull. I can't see it, though. It's hard to read. Yes. I can't read it either. <laughs> Fox skull, Fox skull, pies. I know. D, I see, you see all the W, the A, something blocked... And I think it's two T's at the end. I also only rescued seven instead of... Or, or I should say, I only rescued three in that level instead of four. I wonder who I missed. Anyways, so now we're in crazy Spanish town. So is the uh, level path like predetermined or do you need to yes. go? Yes, it's predetermined. You go where the game sends you. And I just basically s stood there and took it when that guy shot me. Is there anything in here? No. See, there's a reason he's not wearing pants. I think their bullets fly faster on normal. That's my issue. I'm used to the bullets flying a lot. Uh, that guy is not usually there either, that red guy. Wait, so you've never played this game on uh, anything higher than easy? Yeah. There's a reason why I said this is my, basically my own brand of suffering stream. Oh. Because <laughs> we owned this game so back in the sorry. day. We owned this game back in the day, and I never really played it on anything other than easy. My dad and brother played this a lot more, and my dad was a lot better at it than I was. Yeah, you're having a hard time here. It's like, okay, sudden difficulty spot. Fast guy just died there. That bullet went through my head. There's some bullets. Okay, let's try this. Whoa, okay, that was close. <laughs> uh, I almost got a bullet in my face. Grazing like a true Toho. Killed that guy. It's nice to get more points, you know. And those guys are worth 500 points. Come on, do something. There we go. <laughs> it's like I'm waiting for this guy to fire. Because <laughs> he has to, like, stop ducking in order to fire. Man, I got shot in the face again. I gotta start from the beginning, because there's only one midpoint, and it's actually pretty close to the end. Not really a midpoint at all, is it? Not really, no. And I've gotta do all this over again. Wow, this is suffering. That got really painful really quick. And I died again at the same person up there, so yeah. So that's two credits I've used on the third stage. You'll notice I mostly like shooting them in the knees. Yeah, why is that? Knee capping? Uh, it's mostly because it's easier to, uh... It's easier to fire from a ducking position, in my opinion. You're more likely to, to avoid getting shot that way. Yeah, evidently. Okay, let's fire from further back. 
good. Excellent. And there were bullets in here. Good. Ah! I was too close. I stopped ducking too early. And yes, these people can go... Can jump back... Okay, wow, I just stood there and took that bullet. <laughs> well, at least you didn't tell me to do difficult. Yeah, I didn't realize that this was going to be the suffering game. <laughs> oh wow, that guy didn't spawn. Yeah. Okay, I've already rescued her before, so... Uh, let's get bullets. Let's go down here. What's in here? Nothing. Okay, good. I would love to see a tacit. Okay, that's too close. I think I'm stuck. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do! <laughs> no! <laughs> That's perfect. Can't you turn and face left, or do you have to get up? I have to get up. Good game. There we go. I have to take a hit to do it. And he's spawned, despawned, so... See, bullets kill you in one hit anyways. Well, I should say, bullets take away two units of health. Oh, well... No, nope, that didn't work. <laughs> I'm sure you're noticing a pattern here, that all of the yeah. enemies are pretty much the same, and I just took it from that guy again. <laughs> Stop saying took it. It does not go well with the fact that he's not wearing pants. He is wearing pants, damn it. They're like he's khakis. He's not wearing pants. He's naked from the waist down, and that makes me uncomfortable. They're like khaki pants. Whoa, okay, that guy almost smacked me in the face. And I was ducking, so there you go. Those don't look like the army fatigues like in the actual in-game pictures, illustrations, what have you. Okay, I just saw it. Why do you need to drop down there again? Drop? You mean as in ducking? No, drop down there between those two guys. Oh, you could just... Uh, just because. Points. Every 20,000 points is an extra life. And I can use oh. as many of those as I can get. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. So, yeah, that's it. That was my last continue. <laughs> well, this was a short suffering. Um, Unless there's a password system. There is a password system, but I don't know any normal passwords. Oh. Okay, I'll go look it up then. What's your own stage three? I don't know. I mean, should I continue on normal, or do you want to actually see more of the game? Uh, It's up to you. We'll see more of the game. We have to look... We have to watch this again. Because... Although I can make it go faster. Okay, 28... Uh, okay. I know... Well, actually, I can't actually remember. I know it's 0404 something something to get to level 4 and easy. I cannot get the password to load up, evidently. Because GameFAQ has been... Oh, there it goes. Okay, I'm getting so... extraordinarily lucky when I did that jump. This game apparently has a second quest mode? Um... I don't know. I thought it just up upgraded your difficulty. <laughs> oh, Serve thought it was you suffering. Oh, I thought I was where I could get into that door, and I hit up, and I looked away, and I wasn't in the door. 
Okay, I have the passwords up for the next time you need them. Okay, wow, I died on easy. Yay! <laughs> Good job. And now I'm just shooting everything in the face. Run and gun! Be like Mega Man. Stand and shoot. That's pretty much what you have to do in this game. I notice it doesn't seem like you can actually jump while moving forward. You can. Oh, can you? I didn't notice. It's just, you generally, you have to stop to shoot. Stop and shoot, man. I did say that it was a, a, a stick-and-shoot game. <laughs> okay, yeah, that guy jumped in my face. Come on, jump higher. There we go. You're going to have to add people to the conversation if Am we're going to bring anybody into the call. Uh, well, I haven't gotten any requests to come in just yet, so. I get the... well... Serve has expressed interest, obviously, so... Uh oh Because he uh, asked about he, it. He's not... he's not watching, though. I'll just... You know what, I'll do you a solid and drop a link in RSC to save everybody some problems. Yeah, because they're not like me. They don't all, um... Actually, I did took your advice. I saved, like, a folder of the stream links. Yeah, I've got bookmarks for everybody's except for... Oh, whose was it? I think there's at least one that I don't have, and I can't remember whose it was. I hear singing. It doesn't work. Can't jump up from there. Come on, come on, jump, jump. There we go. And we have a second viewer. Who are you, second viewer? <laughs> Reveal yourself! Bomb obtained! Because, also, bombs in NES games. Like, named that way. This game is hardcore. <laughs> I know, isn't it? I got my extra life! Also, that yellow guy wasn't there in the, uh... Oh, nope, I tried to, to go through the floor for some reason. And then I got shot. Well, I've got my bomb still, so... And I did get an extra life. Nope, oh, nope, that guy... That guy hit me in the head and I went forward into the water. No! Shot him. Shot him. Get my machine gun. Forward. 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 Shoot him! Yes, got him. Wait, who was singing? I wasn't singing. I was wondering what happened to you. Let's see, I went in there and... Oh good, that guy's back. Somehow I respawned that guy. It seems you have stopped. <laughs> Just in time for me to finish the level. 
Hooray! Yay, we got the same words as last time. So, okay, I accidentally spoiled this game for myself. Did you now? Yeah. You know what the page says? No, not what the page says, but I do know how it's going to end. Yeah, horribly. For me. Well, that's... Yeah, I guess that's true. <laughs> I don't know how I didn't take a hit there, but okay, whatever. <laughs> Come on, do a, a high jump. There's a guy about that Shiro guy. Shiro? Yeah. That name sounds familiar. There's... Like... We were arguing about the quality of one of his Fantasy Star 4 guides, I think it was. I don't remember that part. I... maybe... I don't know. We were arguing about GameFAQs guides quality. Yeah. Well, I think that GameFAQs doesn't have very many good quality guides for Fantasy Star 4 anyways. But that's just me. Yeah. Shiro's was one of them, and I remember recommending them. And now he has a guide for Codename Viper. What was so. it? Like, a thousand points of separation? thousand points of separation, but... I think it's supposed to be six points of separation, but, it, you know, it's it's more than that now. Nope, this guy's gonna jump. Kill him. See, you can kind of tell the behavior of what they're going to do when based on what they can and can't do. Like, if they're being obstructed, you know that they will try to jump to get to you or get towards you, or whatever. It's just... And then there's that guy. The black guy wearing white. That's what he is! All the other people are, are, are white wearing other colors, but... I wasn't going to say anything. It just makes me laugh. <laughs> Because you know what? Uh, Screw that. Given guy. the action, given the time period that this game must have come out, I I doubt that he is actually a black guy wearing white. Fine, then he's Mexican. I don't know. <sighs> <laughs> no, you're. Well, it's not really current events anymore, but it's uh. Let me see this. What year did this come out? Probably like ninety-one or ninety-two. That's around the time of the Gulf War, right? Let me look. Way to go, Game Facts. You suck. Oh, March 1990. There it is. 90, so, okay. Yeah, so let's see. When was the Gulf War? That was... Oh, no. This actually takes place before the Gulf War. Okay. I learned to think about American history. <laughs> well, there you go. Suffering in your, in your own way. Learning things is not suffering, thank you. <laughs> well, okay, you're right, it's not, but still, some people might consider it that. So and, what you, too big. and when you look on the monitor there, there's, like, a dude being blown away by whatever happened inside the building. You can kind of see it just a little bit. Yeah. That's hardcore. Yeah, I know. So American. Yeah. Guns and bombs and drugs. Don't forget about the drugs. This might have been referenced to some uh, previous... Uh, what's it called? Like... That might have been a reference to some previous Middle Eastern conflict, because we were always unsteady with them during the Reagan administration, evidently. Yeah, those bullets fire so much slower in, uh, on this difficulty. 
from these guys right here. Oh yeah, it does. Wow, that's a difference. Yeah. What would it be like with in difficult mode? Oh jeez. And then you realize that this was the game Toho was based off of. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, look at that. I finally got past the point that I was at before. So this is all new stuff. For me and you. Mostly for me. Pretty much, yes. Woo, doesn't that? Man. I'm dodging like a viper here. That was, oh, that man. was terrible. <laughs> Shut up, serve. And, yep. <laughs> I knew it was going to come up. I knew it. Burp. I don't know. Wait, that's a way to spell bro. Whoa. Whoa. What did I just do there? <laughs> You shot a bunch of people, like an American? Yeah, I dodged a bullet, actually. By jumping over it. in there now. Yep. I just noticed. The twist is that there is not an alien at the end of this. I'll go ahead and tell you that. Yeah, no aliens. Although it's still pretty stupid, so. Birds. I have <laughs> I think I he's saying that this is no longer suffering because I'm not on medium difficulty. <laughs> oh, I made that go by too fast. Nobody was able to see the words. Oh, well. Yeah, I was on medium difficulty and I got stuck on stage three for, for the people listening in. Because they won't join the call for some reason because you, you won't add them or they don't want to be in or something. I don't know. 040471. That's to get to level four on okay. easy. <laughs> it's the Leak's Awakening font. Okay, that's awesome. I didn't know that. Oh yeah, it is. That's neat. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait and let those guys jump in. I love how that's basically discount Africa. That whole island. It's not an island! Oh wait, that island on Link's Awakening. I thought you were talking no, about this game. It's an island on the map of this game. Oh, that's not an island. That's South America. Oh. <laughs> you didn't know? I didn't notice because it was not mentioned. It was mentioned, actually, in the intro. The Did intro... I mention that I failed geography? <laughs> <laughs> so many bullets. So yeah, we're in like ancient ruins now, so we went through and we're like, it was... And I got shot. Hey, congratulations on volunteering, here are you. Oh. Did you just volunteer him for this game? No. Bio Billy. Oh. Yeah, I think I've played that before. A long, 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 long time ago. I can count the games I played on the original Nintendo on like one hand. 
Mega Man 2, uh, Super Mario Brothers 1, and what else? Russian Attack. That's it. I had a small library of games back in the day. My big library was on the Nintendo 64, I'll, I'll be honest. I have a lot of games for that. Wait, what is this guy doing here? I can't remember. Okay. Got my machine gun bullets. What's in here? Nothing. All the enemies replaced by Puyos. <laughs> Can we stack colors of the same pu uh, objects with the same color on them and make them die that way? Because I don't want to shoot Puyos. They're cute. Ah, I tried to jump and it didn't let me. That guy can fire up? What? That guy can fire up? I did not know this. Well, he was aiming at you. <laughs> I didn't know he could fire up. <laughs> I mean, I've never seen him aim, like, up before. So, I guess this means eventually I have to get back on Megamari. Because Race or Aaron stage is next, and I really don't want to do that. And you get, like, the most broken weapon from her. So, we kind of need to do that early. Except for this, that fact that her stage is really friggin' hard. I did a practice run of it, and I was like, yeah, I'm not doing this anymore. Whoops. Down this way. I'm just gonna go straight down this way. Not oh. good. Since I'm thinking about it, and we have other people watching, is that guy that we're playing wearing pants or not? He is! <laughs> Those are white pants. They're like khakis. Those don't look like fatigues. They're not fatigues. This guy isn't a soldier. He's like an agent. And he's wearing clothes that are unnecessary to wear, like, in the jungle. Yeah, fatigues. Also, you're dying a lot in this level. Stop yes, it. I am. Which is too bad, because if I re from what I remember, this was like my second favorite level before. What's your favorite level? It's the, uh, stage six. It's, it's weird. It's hard to describe. Like, I can say, oh, we have the jungle level. Oh, we have the warehouse level. Oh, we have the, uh, Spanish town level. We have the, the ruins level. We have the prison level, because we do. Whoa. The fire. Too strong. And there were bones in there. And there's nothing over there. Okay. Oh, that guy. It's in here. Nothing. Jump over these things. Fast-moving guy. That's fire. Fast-moving guy. Guy who shoots twice. Guy who shoots twice. Ah! Died. At least I reached the halfway point. One. Okay, jumped over that. There wasn't another one. That guy, that guy, that guy. Uh, that guy. Oh, come on.
Okay, that happened. Sometimes they get into a loop of shooting when they can't actually hit you. And they won't move, like, for anything. Bullets. There's my bomb! in here. Another kid to rescue. Good. Got to the end of the level, finally! Jeez. This guy looks like he's in terrible shape. So yeah, that's... Something's happening here. C has gone and made himself all spoiled by this and everything, so... He won't be talking. And there I shot somebody. See? It's on the on the screen. Area 5. The prison. I like the music in this place. Thing up here, there's a kid. Okay, I pulled my laptop away from the door, so maybe you won't hear it. I don't hear anything. Thank God! I, I don't even hear you. Oh, you, wait, you can't hear me? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't believe you fell for that. <laughs> I answered you, how could I have not heard you? <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Oh, wow, this one's definitely going on YouTube. <laughs> if you actually beat your suffering stream in one go, I... No, remember, it's only suffering if I'm playing on something higher than normal. Or, I mean, higher than oh. easy. And also, uh, to be honest with you, I'm probably not going to be able to do it without going through all of my continues because, if I remember correctly, the last stage in particular is, like, insane. Why are there fucking zombies out here? They're prisoners. And they're so thin they can get through the bars. Oh. That's that's dark, actually. Mm-hmm. And that's, I guess, a Brazilian prison for you. Note that it's Capcom's fault, not mine. They're, they're the ones that made the game. Isume did not reanimate the corpses. Oh gosh, this stuff. This is supposed to be a prison, but there's also right. lab equipment and weird green stuff falling from the ceiling. What the hell? Is this Castlevania 3 now? I don't know. I never played Castlevania 3. You I've, should. It's a good game. I've played Castlevania 2. Oh, yeah. Add that to my list of games I've played on Nintendo Castlevania 3. I did not ever beat it. I got, like, halfway through Yay, another heart.
These are some very questionable level design choices. <laughs> like, these are just elements that don't work together. Ow. How did that thing hit me? Exactly. It had already, it had already like, gone through the floor. Oh well, at least I got a 1-up. Hitboxes. I'd like to mention those weird green drops do as much damage to you as a, uh, as a bullet. So there's a one-shot in higher difficulties. Cool. Well, it's a one-shot when you only have two little health, uh, dots. Did I have any bullets that I can find around here? Because that's what I need now, is bullets. I can't remember where I found bullets. There's time. That thing almost hit me. Okay, I think there's bullets down here. No, there isn't. Up here, then. No. Where's my bullets? Up here? Yes. Bullets! Pew pew. What's in here? Nothing. Okay. Jump. At least I can get one ups there every time, so I, I probably won't need to do continues here. I have passports on hand anyway, so. Yeah, but I don't think they have individual passwords for individual levels of each difficulty. They do, and they don't. Uh, there's like a... Let me just grab it. Yeah, the game game facts thingy actually has uh, passwords for each difficulty. Well, yeah, I know, but I'm saying is that do you have ones to get you to specific levels on each difficulty? Yes. All of them? Uh, not all of them. Yeah, but, uh, I didn't think so. There's probably only two listed for easy, are there? Uh, no. There's one for easy, normal, hard for level one, easy, normal, hard for three, easy, normal, hard for... Yeah, for all of them. Except there's actually some for a second quest, but not for the first quest. This game evidently has a second quest for some reason? I don't know. Do not know. So Half yeah, of... we got more of this. Half the fun of the suffering stream is finding out more to suffer about. Yeah, I guess so. Our whole purpose is to control the world by supply as much as something, 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 something. something I rescued something, something. five somethings in that level, huh? I didn't know I could rescue five. Anyways, this is my favorite level. And go figure, this is the one that doesn't have a password. Level 6 doesn't have any passwords? There's a password for level 6, but it doesn't say for what difficulty. Oh, nice. 529-5956. Anyways, my, the reason why I love this so much are these. Stream delay, stream delay, stream delay, what? Elevators? Not just elevators. Look at these things. Zoom tubes! Yeah, pretty much. Neat. We chemical plant zone now. Look at that corruption up there. <laughs> we got some gray, we got some green, we got some pink. I don't know what's going on there. Interesting. Electricity on the floor. Does that make sense? Ooh, dodging. Thank goodness you go invulnerable as soon as you get to the door. 
Yeah. You can go through people who are coming down the elevators. Bones. Oh yay, another heart dot thing. Okay, oh, more of that. More of that. Whoa, okay. Whew. I saw the electronic or electron thing on the floor, and I ducked. And now I went down the thing, and I don't know what's up there anymore. Why don't you come down here? Come on. Why don't you? No, don't stand there. Get out of my way. Nope. Okay, that's not working. I'm just gonna go up here. Suddenly it's the fight maze. Yeah, I know, it's... <laughs> disorienting, to say the least. Whoa, okay, yeah, that's nice. So, start of the stage, because I have no freaking clue what could be a halfway point. Rip. I need bullets. There we go, I got bullets. Part of the problem is when you always duck and shoot, and you're standing in one of these things, these zoom tubes, it uh, doesn't really work. Because they take you down. Yep. Bruh. <laughs> why? <laughs> okay. Why? I don't know. Why can't you hear anything? Is your stream muted? Nope. Well, I mean, hers might be. Yeah. I'm. I'm certainly not muted. The music is going. You can hear it, can't you? Uh, if you turn it up, I, could you? I. If I unmute the stream, certainly. Because I don't want to hear myself. Did. I always find it weird to listen to myself when I'm streaming. I mean, like, not streaming, uh, even in my recorded videos, I, I think I sound weird. Yeah, the music's fine. I can hear it. And you can hear me. Yeah, of course. <clears throat> wow, that was, uh, excuse me. Oh, see, there's the bomb. I would have missed this if I hadn't gone here. And there's another kid. See, I would miss things if I had just kept going the way I was trying to go. Wow. Let's keep going. I don't want to go up there. Because there's electricity there. I gotta wait for it to come by and... Oh, there's another person. Ah, falling from the freaking ceiling! And there's the end of the level. Tech gone! We have only one little bit left on this oh. page. Supply as much drugs to as possible, and he will handle it. And they don't tell you where his home is in. It's like, don't contact him, even though he can be found in his home here. That's weird. I can hear it just fine. Oh, hey, I got an extra life or continue. I don't know. There's my password for level 7. Yeah, I didn't get an extra life. I got an extra continue. Conveyor okay, belts. So the, the passwords that I have here are all for easy mode. All of them. Okay, yeah. Oh. And that's easy mode first quest, by the way. So if you do need it.
Uh, check your flash settings, Hisame? I don't know. I don't know what to tell you because... It... I know Hitbox streams using flash, I think. Yes. Like most of them do. Yeah. I think that it's like HTML5 is not, not at the point where it can do streaming just yet. Oh, by the way, spikes will kill me in one hit. Which proves this is a Capcom game. <laughs> but they also kill the enemy in one hit. Oh, well, that's a cool detail. Oh, are those things like a hurty thingy? Yes, they hurt. More time, yay! Rescuing people. Oh, this is a horrible thing to do to you. I almost stepped on those spikes. This is a very, very evil place. Oh, I just conveyed myself into spikes. Good so job. I gotta start over the level. No, I get to start at the halfway point. Really. Interesting. I didn't know continue started you at the halfway point. Thank you, serve, for that. Yep, I died because I did a weird jump. I like how that guy just hides inside the fucking crates, just busts out like, yeah! That's what he does, yes. What? That, okay, okay, his trigger? I have to land on the stupid metal thing. <laughs> That's perfect. If I, if I jump over the metal thing, he doesn't show up. Okay, this place is evil because right there, those, that... And that. Did they just try to drop a steel beam on you? Yes. Holy crap. Yeah. Well, 2 HP is what we normally have. Apparently, he was picking up health ups. Yes, I was. And it's not that everything does 2 damage, spikes are instant death, anyways. And just a lot of things do do two damage, especially, uh, especially bullets. Yay, I got my machine gun back. So, this is the... These are some great positions for these guys. Strategically speaking. Now, if only they could aim downward. Well, that guy that can aim upward normally aims downward. That's why I didn't think he could aim upward. So I've got my bomb. There's these guys. A bunch of them. And I reached the end of the stage. Now for the one that hates me. This is a stage that hates me. Oh no. Supply as much drugs to Commander Jones of Special Missions... His home is in Beverly Hills. This is only the guy that gave us the mission to do all this crap. So basically, this is Metal Gear. <laughs> Commander and Big Jones boss is... is to Commander Jones. Commander yes. Jones is really dealing in drugs. I'll never allow Jones to do such a uh, hateful thing. Wait, why is it hateful? And now we're no longer giving him video feed of where we're at, I guess? So, no longer going to South America, we're going to North America, but we don't get to see where. <laughs> Drugs are bad, okay? <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. Anyways, so now we've got... Now we've got a lot more... Oh, I did something stupid there. Wow, suddenly we are in a palace. It's this guy's mansion in Beverly Hills. Why the... Never mind. Is it as nice as the mansion that Franklin got in Grand Theft Auto V? Uh, it's bigger, I think. Is 
So these guys, in the black uniform, they like to jump towards you. Right. They're, like, really good at that. That was a great duck, by the way. Ah, I got shot by... Yeah. Yeah, this place is going to kill me. Oh, Hisame finally got her, uh... region thing sorted out. Good for her. No. I think this guy can shoot downward, too, by the way. The guy in the black uniform. I don't risk it. Cap him. Yeah, that's what I did. Firebomb guy. That guy can jump. That guy jumps too. And come on up here. Come on, do it. Got you. Okay, what am I doing? Ah! Why did I do that? He fired and then I sh moved towards him. Why? Long stage then? Wow, what are you yelling about here, you? Uh -huh. Oh, Hisame, you are in for a treat. Actually, she can't hear me if she's still having problems. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow, I almost jumped into a bullet. Ow. No. I also almost jumped on that guy's head. Forget it, I'm moving forward. Whoa! Ah! Yeah. Lightning. Wait, there's an actual lightning storm? Well, the lightning hits the statues, and the statues throw off, like, boulders. Their heads. That's... that's an... uh... That, that's creative, I guess. Also, this guy has a tower. He had to fuck this game. And you ha- I wow, there is no midpoint. Unless the midpoint was somewhere on the tower. This is the stage that I probably won't get past. This is the last stage, too, so... <laughs> I've made that joke several times here, you. Ah! I got shot in the back of the head. I don't get shot in the back of the head. <laughs> uh, the, um... Yeah, that's, that's right. That's... Why did that guy jump from? I shot him in the foot. And I'm playing terribly right now.
that, what are you doing, you idiot? They're never going to get that reference. I don't remember that reference. Ah, Damn. I got shot in the face. That guy. I hate him. I can't do Stop a damn shot. Just I can't run. do a damn thing about him. I'm trying to run. Come on, guy in black. So now there are no people to rescue? Or are there? I don't think there are, no. You don't even need a bomb guy. It's just getting bullets, and I think those are the only two places to get bullets. Alright, got past that. Why did I do that? I don't know. Why did you do that? I was trying to move forward so I can shoot that guy a second time, and instead, I got up and got a bullet to the face. So, last life. No continues left. Eh, continues are overrated. I have the passport anyway. <laughs> Okay. Well, why'd I do that? Why'd I do that? Jump straight up into his foot. How do you get inverse Goomba stomp? <laughs> because he was above me and I jumped straight up. Come forward a little bit more. Keep going. Whatever. I did it again! Oh well, that's game over. Okay, let's let's do something fun. Let's see what happens. They can see the beginning of this because they missed all of the first stages. Oh this god. Is really good. This is really gonna kill me. <laughs> Because I'm not used to this at all. I think these guys move faster. Yeah, they are. Oh, gosh. God. Whoa, how the hell did I do that? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> no, no, there's more to it than them moving faster. It gets worse later on. Whoa, did you see that dodging, Mo? Yeah. I don't know how I did it. <laughs> oh, wow. This is just... On jump. There you go. I like how everyone kind of looks like Grant. Who? Grant did nasty guys of ninety three. Kinda. He is a ghost. Castlevania pirate. is Konami, and this is this is uh, Capcom. Capcom. Back when Capcom actually meant something. So I gotta do it that used over to again. Something? Well, back I'm when... sad. Street Fighter V does not look as great. All they really did with Bison is they gave him a skirt. Uh. Why is Bison still alive? I mean, seriously. How many times has he died? 
it's, I, but I can't remember. I counted it in the thread. First death was in Street Fighter Alpha 3. Second death was in uh, Street Fighter 2. Because he got Shun got Goku Satsu in the fucking soul. Whoa. And then Whoa. he's still alive in 4. And for some reason, still doing shit in 5. Which apparently is going to take place before 3. Again. Uh... I'm sad because Street Fighter 3 does not get enough love. I want Alex back, damn it. We need more hypo bomb. Is Dan well, still a thing that exists? To. Is what a what not what? Is Dan still a thing that exists? Yeah, he's, he's in Street Fighter 4 too. Actually, in the original version of Street Fighter 4, he was the uh, training dummy. He wore like a uh, he wore like hockey gear while you beat up on him. Still uh, rocking the pink gear. Yep. Evidently, it used to be a white gi, but he forgot to uh, separate his pinks from his shirt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like that. That's great. That is apparently the canon story. <laughs> I don't know why, but, you know. Oh, crap! Those guys shoot fast. The ones that come out of the walls? Yeah. Did, like, basically the difficulty mode is just speeds up the bullets, right? Well, yeah, it seems that way. Speeds up the bullets, speeds up the guys. You don't get points if you shoot them and they fall down the water. Oh, uh, here's my kinda... bomb. I already got that. Oh, good. I killed him and I got an extra life. Oh, good. Okay, there's nothing in there. No more guys. Come on, no more guys. <laughs> because the last thing I need is to be shot. Comes a person. Hey, he's... I should ask, ask her in the chat. Apparently she's still having some problems. Oh, crap. Streams on the brain? Yes. You know how dyslexia is. Mm-hmm, yep. I know all about the Listexia. You did that shit on purpose. Nope. I mean, what shit? the one in yellow. Oh! Wrong button! I tried to go through the floor instead of jumping. Oh, is it one of those games that uses the up button on the pad to jump? No. You have oh. to hold down to go through the floor while you down and jump to go through the oh. floor. So basically, duck, then jump, and you'll go down. Why couldn't it just be double tap down? I mean, honestly. I never got games that did that. I don't mind it. It's pretty intuitive to me. Oh. I'm spoiled by Smash Bros. Well, now, with Smash Brothers, I just use the... I don't know. I can't remember what I used to do it. Well, nope, that didn't work either. So I just died right off the bat there. Nice one. I know. I love how the difficulty mode is all it takes for you to just have a lot more trouble. Yeah! 
I mean, I can start anticipating some of this ch crap, but at the same time... You know what? Screw it. I don't need to do any of this. He's I now know what the reason... Well, that guy spawned. Yeah. So I now know the reason for the machine gun. Oh, yeah? Yeah, because generally, you want to just keep firing while those guys are popping out of the wall. So that way you don't, you know, uh, die to them. Oh, what, your bullets eclipse their bullets or some shit? No, but uh, basically if you're already uh, firing, by the time they actually pop out of the wall, they'll die. They hit well. I did it again. I should have jumped and instead I tried to go through the floor. And so basically the machine gun was made for the higher difficulty levels. So it is. Huh. Although it really does seem like you, you need to know your enemy placement through playing ahead of time. Yeah, pretty much. Yay, I got through the first level on difficult! <laughs> Finally, jeez. <laughs> Under the warehouse. Also, the end of level pictures are the same. And that's Commander Jones's hands folded on the desk. He's watching. Right. He's yep. satisfied because we're making progress. But the whole point, I guess, is to make progress and then fail. That way, he can say, well, we tried, and then he can go on with his drug business. This game doesn't make sense. Why is my fan turned off? So, I couldn't move because I was pinned down by the gunfire, and so that guy just walked into me and killed me. Oh. Rest in peace, fan. Your fan died? Yep. Well, that's good, because I'm dying, too. I was wondering why it uh, wasn't working. Oh, it is working. Evidently, some wires broke, so we're... Huh. Okay, so some of the wires inside got torn, so they'll only actually make the electrical connection with the cord fence or anyway. Cute. Ah, oh, shit. That's more shit for me to replace. I should say that if you run out of bullets on both of them, you will technically never truly run out of bullets on your handgun. What happens is they, um... They'll count down to zero, but then you'll immediately get a bullet back. But the thing is, it takes a moment. It's like, re wow, look at how fast the pink one shoots. Oh my gosh. Wow, that that's didn't like work. no delay. That didn't work at all. Could sneak up underneath them. Maybe. Tack gone. You're getting fucked from both ends over there. Yeah, I am. Put your pants on. It might stop happening. <laughs> I'm wearing pants, damn it. <laughs> Just had to make him walk forward enough that he went down. <laughs> yes! yes. 
That's what I needed right there. <laughs> Bones. Well, and I'm going to have to do this all over again, again, again. Hmm. Ow, my neck. There's the pink shooty one. There he is. Pink shooty one. Yes, the one in pink that shoots. <laughs> Self-explanatory. Why did I do that? Stomping on their heads doesn't work. Okay, that was game over. <laughs> so it took me until on easy I can get to the last stage. On on normal I can get to stage 3 and on difficult I can get to stage 2. Yay. Anybody else want to do something instead? <laughs> uh, well, shit. People were bugging me about it last night, so I can do Super Mario Brothers 2. Okay. I'm gonna stop now.